Well, hello, folks, and this is our book focus for July, where we encourage each other to be reading good Christian books. Of course, the first prize is that we read in the Bible every day if we can. But in addition to that, it's always really helpful to read um, other good Christian books. And remember, we noted there were four reasons for that. Reading helps us to pause and to reflect on our Christian life. It helps us to grow as we have access to knowledge of others. Others have gone before us or others who understand things better than us. And so that's a fantastic way for us to grow. It helps us to prepare for ministry because as we mature, we're able to serve others better. And then finally, it should really be drawing us to a place of worship of God and prayer. If books are truly about Jesus and are growing our faith, we are going to be one of you worshiping God and praying. And so that's why reading is such a good thing. Now, the book I wanted to draw your attention to this month is called According to Plan by Graham Goldsworthy. It's this book over here, According to Plan by Graham Goldsworthy. I came across this book about 15, 20 years ago when I was studying and getting ready uh, for ministry. And what I absolutely loved about it was how uh, Goldsworthy was able to show how the Old and the New Testaments fit together and how it tells one story about Jesus. Um, I don't know about you, but for a long time, I had all sorts of ideas about what the Bible was on about. All these disparate stories, you know, Daniel in the lion's den and Moses in the wilderness and uh, then the beasts in the book of Revelation and then, of course, the gospel stories with Jesus and his miracles, but not having any idea how these things fitted together, if they did at all. But what I've realized and what I've learned over the years is that they do. And they fit together in a very powerful way and in a beautiful tapestry way to teach us about Jesus and all that he's done for us. And so according to plan is a fantastic work to help you to see how the whole story of the Bible fits together. By reading according to plan and spending some time thinking about what it means, you will have a terrific grasp on how the whole Bible fits together. No matter where you're reading in the Bible, you'll know how to interpret it how to understand it as Christian scripture, as scripture about Jesus, as Jesus taught us to. So can I encourage you, according to plan, if you can get this book, order it, buy it wherever you can. It'll be a great read for you. Why don't you commit to reading this through the month of July? God bless you.